Hello, my fellow outcasts. You already know what time it is. The new album, Hope, is out. And I recorded some of my reactions to um, some of the songs that he has on his album. Um, sorry, I look super crusty right now. But um, those will be a video cut on me because my phone is dying. Surprise. Um, so, yeah, so I will be posting some of those videos. Um don't know if i'll post all of them let me know what you guys uh want to see but i don't think i'm going to be posting all of them because i got super emotional during um some of the songs so um and my boyfriend did also and he did the reactions with me so yeah definitely during mama uh was super just you could see the raw reactions on me and my boyfriend kobe's face like that's a hard song to listen to all the way through without crying. Um, unless, you, you know, you haven't struggled with that. But um, just a lot of pure emotion from Nate in this album. Um, you know, this album is so different for Nate than any of his other albums he's come out with. Even his mixtape, Clouds um very different from the search so since his last album actual album this is a huge change and he even talks about that in one of his songs um something like my confidence never been higher in one of the songs um from this album so i don't special about me you can already tell the energy is different see energy is different this is at the highest level i don't ever see it dipping confidence if you want to guarantee though you're gonna wish you hadn't did it that's a word that you can never win, but hey, I like the optimism. This is the line I was talking about, in Pandemonium. I think that's so cool, and he mentions how different um, his style is. Like, my style is different, um, and I love that. Like, he's exploring this new side of him, kind of like the white and black thing. I guess you should say the black to white, um, and I feel like that symbolizes some confidence that he's gaining throughout putting out his music you know having his son his wife i mean he's he's building his life and i i think that really plays a part in his confidence being higher and i certainly do feel like this album really was great at showing um healing you know, with his previous albums, like, Mama is basically a transition from How Could You Leave Us, and How Could You Leave Us was, like, his song about grief about his mother, um, you know, how he's, like, gonna find it hard to forgive her, and then in Mama, he talks about how he's forgiven her, and even without even in the other song he has, um, I can't remember because the album's so fresh. He says, don't worry, that wasn't a shot, mama. I forgive you. And I'm like, I just don't want my kid to grow up the same way he did. And I, like, I lost it at that line. I, this is all my main takeaway from this album is Nate is in his healing era. Like, not only... Uh, forgiving his mom, but forgiving him his self, um, like, with, in the song Running, um, I really think that song is talking about his past self, and he's, like, letting go of his past self, and here's his fresh, clean slate, like, the white, I keep talking about the white, but I really think, you know, white is a pure color and it symbolizes purity and everything. So I really feel like that's his clean slate. Like he's trying to symbolize this as his clean slate. This is my takeaway. So um, feel free to add in the comments below, like what your main takeaway is or kind of what your thoughts are with this album. But I really think that's what he's trying to show is that he, he, he's starting over.